Hey guys, it's Jay. <clears throat> so today I'm going to do a get ready with me makeup chit chat, I guess. <sighs> so, today's Friday, uh, July the 8th. It's already late. It's uh, like 10.15 in the morning. So I still need to make up my bed, but I'm going to do my makeup first. <clears throat> so it's been a really, a really horrible week for the nation, for the greatest nation of all, for America. It's been a horrible week. <clears throat> Um, yesterday, Thursday, my, I don't watch a lot of the news, and if I do, it's only like local news, it's Channel 4, it's Fox 4, and it's only local news, not really, um, national news. And then if I do, it's, and here recently this week, I really haven't wa been watching it in the mornings because I'm like, you know, same old, same old. But, uh, there's been police murders, murderers, murders. There's been murders that has taken place unlawfully, unjustified by the police in in America. My husband got home yesterday. Yesterday I spent the day with my mom. We were, we had gone up to Arlington to the mall. I had to do a specific thing. And my sister sent me this video and while we were in Macy's, I, I attempted to look at it. You know, I saw maybe three seconds of it and then my mom was walking away. So I was like, you know, I, I, I never watched it. Um, classic tan. So I never watched it. My husband gets home. He's like, did you see those videos? And I guess they've been out for the week or whatever. And, and I said, no. He's like, well, they're on, they're on the internet. You can look at them. I'm like, I don't want to look. And he explained it to me, both of them. Both of them. He explained them to me. And I was disgusted. I was so disgusted. I was like, what? Why are they doing that? Like, they... I'm like, he wasn't doing anything? Immediately, my stomach began to hurt. I was... I was... I was taken aback. I'm like, that's not legal. Like, that's not... I was completely upset. You know, I was in a good mood all day. And he told me that, and I'm like, that's horrendous. This color's a little too. That's horrendous, babe. He's like, it's fucked up. It's fucked up. It's fucked, you know. I'm like, that's horrible. You know, me and my husband, we have black friends, you know, whatever. You know, Africa, we have, we have, I mean, we, we don't call them, we don't think of them as our black friends. We have friends. You know, they come to our house, we go to their house whatever it's not a big deal but in, in the manner that they were m murdered I don't know and then I start to see footage I start looking at you know just previously recorded news coverage or whatever I see one of the man's oldest son 15 years old weeping 
understandably, right? I'm just, it just, my heart's still pounding right now. <sighs> okay, so I never really watched the video. We spend the evening together as a family. We come back inside. We watch Lone Star Law. You know, I'm just like, this, this is horrible. So I'm getting into bed around 10. And uh, I check my phone per usual, you know, just to make sure I didn't miss a call or whatever. And I have a message from my sister. And she normally is in bed by 8. <laughs> so I, I got the message around 9, 940 something. She says, are you seeing what's happening in Dallas? So I'm like, to me, I'm like, what the fuck's happening in Dallas? Nothing's, hap nothing's happening in Dallas. So I turn on the TV real quick, and the first thing that pops up is a strip on top, because we have satellite or whatever, and it sh tells you what channel it, like what it is. Like what, show, like what show it is, and it says Modern Family. So as, 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 soon as, I read it, I, as soon as I read it, I click it off because, I mean, I don't watch that show. But as I'm turning it off, the screen comes up and it's the news, Dallas. Like, and so it turns off, so I turn it back on. <clears throat> and it's disgusting. Like, I, like I had just kind of like put the information that I got to the back of my mind kind of nobody likes to think evil things like nobody likes it to, to dwell in ugliness and I know it's easy for me to push it to the back of my mind I know you guys are like well it's easy for you to push it back but I mean I did and then to uh and like to see like what's happening like freaking down the street you're right like I get it I get it like, it's not just those two men who died this week. It was the ones before. The kid before. You know, the people who don't have a footage of their unlawful murder. You know, it's everybody. It's all of these black people. I understand. I, I get it. But then to come and do this, here. I mean, how do you know that the people that some of the people that they murdered aren't married to a black woman or a black man? You know, how, how do they know? You know, like they were just shooting at these police officers. And I just, I just like sat up in my bed and I was like watching the news until 12 o'clock and I was seeing like one of the guys shooting and and then, I, and then fear settled in, and I'm like, why? Like, why? Why are they doing this? Like, why is anybody doing this? Why do the cops do what they do? And I know it's not, and I know it wasn't the people of the march, right? They were marching peacefully. I wish I had a Black Lives Matter shirt. I guess I could make one, whatever. Because, like, that's enough. Like, it's been enough. Like, there is no just, but there is no justification for what happened to those men and women in uniform. There's no justification. <sighs> um, I'm not even doing this in order, you guys. I hate to say that I'm living in fear, but I mean, and then like to see the footage, they were doing this manhunt for that guy in the camo shirt. And my first reaction is, this is an open carry state. Like my goodness, you're, and I know they were just looking for the person of interest, but I mean, if, I mean, what was to say if he came up trying to speak to the cops, saying, hey, that's me, you know, and they 
took that as a threat and they shot his ass too. Like, when does it stop? Like, I feel like these cops are not all, but some of them, because they are afraid, they get tr tr like trigger happy. You know what? That's part of your job. That's part, you know, taking on this job every day, not just on a day of a rally, but every, any day is a day that you might not make it home. And you, but you're supposed to be willing to take that risk. Okay, that's why I'm not a cop, because I'm not going to take that risk. I don't know. And then supposedly that one man who was shot, one of the suspects who just wouldn't give up, wouldn't give in, was like, I hate white people. And he just wouldn't go down. He just would not comply. And they, and instead of going back and forth, like every time they got closer, there was always an exchange of fire. And so finally they had to, um, they had to, uh, do like a robotic thing with a bomb because they had, because they weren't going to risk more cops. And I get it too. Because, I mean, apparent to hear the mayor or the chief of police say it, he was not, he was not backing down. I'm sad. I know it's not everybody in the world. I know it's not because it's not me. I know everybody in the world is not like that because there's a bunch of good people out there. It's just as hard to understand what's going on. I spoke to my mom this morning. I called her before 7. I was awake again. I was awake by 6 watching the news again. <laughs> and I called her and I, you know, I cried to her. And all she could tell me was like, Janet, you know, these are the signs of the times. You know, Jesus is coming soon. Not just you, but everybody needs to seek him. To look for him. To search for him. Because it, because it's written, and like I don't know, like I know one day the world's gonna end, but are we that close? Like, is this it? And we're just so dumb, we're so stuck up, we're so like self-absorbed and stuck up social media's ass that we can't see it. And I'm not perfect, you guys. My goodness, Look, I'm not perfect. This is the Becca thing. Uh, but it's like, you know, maybe I need to spend more time in prayer. I mean, we all do, but there is no answer. There's no right answer. Love is the answer. If we loved each other, none of this would have ever happened. We would have been more patient with each other, more compassionate. I mean, I don't know, it's just been a tough, tough morning, I'm sure, for everybody. I mean, God be with the, with the family members who've, who've lost their loved ones all week this week. Unjustly. Their lives were taken away. And it's crazy because there is no right. Like, the cops weren't right. Those men w w weren't aggressive, you know, like they weren't, like there was nothing right about that. And I, and I don't want what happened in Dallas to outshine or whatever, throw off the course what's going to happen to those police officers because absolutely they, they need to be held accountable. Absolutely. freaking I don't know. And then my husband says that there's there's probably more. There's probably more. <sighs> Anyways, I'm getting ready to go see my uncle. He had knee surgery Tuesday. A total knee replacement. And he's home already. So I'm going to look decent. Go to H-E-B, pick him up some flowers or something, and go visit him. 
um, here in August my mother's going to have the same surgery and I'll be her primary caretaker so you guys just have me in your thoughts because I mean I don't know what to do I don't know what to do and my son's like mom what's happening and I try to explain to him without freaking him out but I do need him to know but when I tell him he doesn't really understand he doesn't realize that it's here in Dallas like this Dallas like the one that we go to for dinner or to go play at Warren Clyde Park I feel like I'm old I feel like yesterday and today like I, I feel like my face has been like like, like, I feel like I've aged. <sighs> Anyways, I know you guys have, some, I think you guys would have some opinions on it. I already have my list of the people, I'm, I'm, of everybody who's entered in my giveaway. I'm, today probably I'll I'll try to go ahead and uh, cut them up and and pull it out for you guys so that this weekend you guys can contact me really haven't been watching that many YouTube videos not that many I'm just kind of been enjoying the time our uh, vacations coming up will be gone soon so I'm getting ready for that. Tomorrow is Saturday. We're going to have a yard sale to try to get rid of some of some clothes that we don't use. You know, school's going to come up really soon. So I need to get rid of the clothes that my son's not using. Hold it. And um, do you guys even want to watch me get ready? I don't have much to say. sorry doesn't cut it you know I'm I wouldn't want to hear I'm sorry that's why a lot of times like when someone when someone I know has a loved one who's passed away or is sick or something like I don't even want to say I'm sorry not because I'm not but because I I personally wouldn't want to hear it really it doesn't change anything. If anything, I'll say like my condolences because I'm sorry. You're, what are you sorry for? You didn't do anything, you know? See, my makeup doesn't even look cute. I'm all done with it. I hope you guys are doing good. I hope you guys are taking it okay. See, without even wanting to, I make this stink face. Like, I'm not even wanting to, that's just how I feel. I just feel like. Like, this is me trying to, like, just look regular. <sighs> Alright, you guys, that's it. I'm just going to probably put some mascara on and some eyeliner. Let's put some color on. Should I do pink? I don't even know what I'm going to wear. Let me get ready. And I'll put on my lip with you. We'll do our lips together. So I'll see you guys soon. 
hey guys it's me so I'm gonna go ahead and just show you my lip um, I just have some silver earrings I have this black shirt it says American Grappling Federation I have some just blue jeans and my Converse my black Converse okay let's have something in my nose So just uh, what I'm using is today, I'm going to do the Maybelline New York Matte. The color is in 690, Siren and Scarlet. Siren and Scarlet, this is the top, the lid, the purple, but it's a red matte color. And that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and try to upload this to my channel, and um, and that's it. I'll leave a comment if you feel so inclined. Let me know your thoughts and, and opinions if you have any. It's going to, like everything, it's going to pass, whatever. It's just crazy. It's just too much. It's just... It's just too much. We are, we're supposed to be the freaking, we're supposed to be America, and we're freaking, we're just like this, and it's never going to work. And then other countries, get, other countries are going to see that, and, and that'll be, that'll be it for us, you guys. So, I love you, and take care. Bye.